Ooh, welcome back guys, it's me again, Cypher, and here we are continuing the Total War Warhammer 2 campaign, playing as the Wargrove of Fo or Draika. So, uh, let's jump in. As you can see, uh, we secured the other forest. So the economy will be boosted shortly. Uh, we have the force encounters and we will be dealing with them now. After that, we'll decide what to do uh, around this forest. And uh, we will be sending this guy to finish off with the, um, with the quest uh, to have uh, the legendary hero. Uh, so, uh, let's see what do we have here. Okay, so we have good uh, garrison. Let's see the diplomacy. So, most likely they will yes. be the guy that will be fighting uh, to get Durthu. So, either these guys or the dwarves uh, on this side. Uh, let's see, we need to secure a road so we can have a trade agreement with this a faction but first we need to know if we need to fight these guys or no now most likely I will be fighting them I'll just wait a bit uh, we have better matters to attend to and uh, Ostland is one of them now uh, I'd rather be having a defensive alliance with these guys so I can prevent Reichland from declaring war on me. And I suppose I'll be doing that. So now if Reichland decided to declare war on me, they will be uh, taking into consideration the dwarves and they will increase the balance of power a lot. They are reliable. And uh, we will be having more chances to avoid wars in the future. Uh, as for this guy, we're gonna be taking a look around here. Uh, now I might declare war on this faction because I want to secure the port. So I can start uh, doing trade agreements with the other elves. Yeah, so this is something good to do in fact. Uh, let me first just see what do we have here. Oh, I know I'll be... Uh, I'm gonna auto-resolve it. Uh, I'm gonna be having uh, more cash. And I'll bring him back in to see what we can recruit for him. Uh, um, we need something fast. But I'd rather be giving him Hawks instead. The thing is, Hawks are large units. They are good, it's not like they are bad. But the dogs... Let's bring him in. He might need a couple more treemen to boost his army. We also need to improve the power of uh, his dryads. Uh, yeah, we're going with simulate growth and we're gonna increase uh, the mobility. As for these guys, I'll care about them later. It's not giving us anything good. And we need to improve the power of Draika, so yeah. I'll bring her in the tree, make some changes to her armies, to her army, and uh, I'll wait a bit, just we need to make sure we are running green on the economy. Now this is, this is really important, we need to capture it soon. Athalorin isn't bad, but we need to secure a port. Uh, we checked the diplomacy, we do not have anything here, so let's end the turn. Ok, 
Okay, good. Faction destroyed. Now we will not be having... Okay. Okay, so they are the ones that were uh, besieging the dwarves. Now I want to know why they are heading this way. They left their land for what reason? And I'm serious about that. Are they at war with anyone? Oh, they are at war with this faction. Okay, okay, okay. Makes sense. Let's bring her this way. And uh, I highly doubt that we can fight them now. So I'll be recruiting uh, some more. Oh, yeah, let's do that. Have two of this guy. And one of this guy. We need more... Uh, maybe Dryads. Okay, so they are fast units. Well, not the fastest, but not bad. And maybe I'll be giving him some Hawks. As for these units, we'll see what to do. You are going to be facing this guy. And I want to give her six tree men. So... Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, six or seven. Let, let's let make them seven, so eight plus uh, the legendary hero that makes uh, nine. And uh, then we will be sending her this way. Yeah, uh, I'll be doing that. Now let's see what we can do with... Um, with... The humans or the empire. They hate me a lot. The empire. Most likely they will be declaring war on me. And get from my unless I declare war on the so I do not want it. So the Empire. You stand. As you can see everyone hates me. Even though I tried hard to improve the relations with the surrounding in the previous, uh, in the first 20 turns by declaring war on the uh, Sylvanian. Okay, so they peaced out as well. Wanted to declare war on them while they were at war so I can have better relations with the dwarves, but it seems that they decided. to have a peace treaty. Now, first of all, we're gonna be taking out this guy, then we'll be sending her this way to recruit. Okay, easy. More cash. Uh, she's going on force march. Uh, can we have more? No, we can't. Okay, now what to have? This is not bad. This is not useful for this faction. I love this mount a lot because it does not take out anything of the hero. It only gives her boost in everything. Uh, she will become large and she will not be able to go on walls like having this one for example this more versatile i love this one a lot i'm gonna keep her on foot for now and i'll keep on focusing on her melee uh, traits uh so yeah let's have this one and let's see what the Dryad has. I'll go with increasing growth because she's going to be in here for a while while recruiting. And uh, this guy going to be having a Hawk. 
or let's give him these units. Yeah. Not building him a doom stack yet, but that's enough for him at the moment. Let's get. Yeah, let's have that. Then we're gonna have that. Uh, let's see the growth, how much we're getting. Plus 60. Okay. Not ideal. We need to get the. Uh, these faction, these this uh, this territory and uh, they're providing any growth? No. Okay, only growth from here. Okay, but I need it. Oh, we do have it here. Okay, no problem. So let's end the turn. Bordello. Oh no, I thought Bordello has the Sword of Cain. I was like, holy crap. How would they end up getting it? Okay, it doesn't provide anything special, so yeah. Where is the... Uh... Okay, there it is. Gonna have both of them to fight. Uh, now we are back in the red. I'll have him initiate the fight so he can increase in level. We need to go down the... Uh... Okay, yeah, let's do that. Easy auto-resolve, cool. And uh, let's give him some cash. Now we can focus on sending him towards... Um... The Gordon Local Province, uh, nothing good. So she's getting in. In four turns, this forest will be uh, healed. Mortality. Plus, okay, next turn we can. Have, uh, nothing. So. Uh, well, to heal, I need to keep him in. And I'd rather be sending him north instead. Because I do not want to go through Reichland's territory. This will be uh, bad uh, for the relations with them. Let's give her the uh, healing power. And uh, for her, we're going to be... Giving her the Talon of Kornos first. As for you, let's give you... I'm gonna keep on sticking with the ambush. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with the ambush. Or let's first give the Dryad some damage. Okay. Now for the lady. She can recruit three units, so let's embed the units. And we're gonna be taking out one triad for now. Have three of these guys. Uh, let's see what to give her now. So we have the triad improvement. Now we need the tree man improvement. And we're gonna be giving her that. Okay. Cool. Now they have 30%, 20%, so they can withstand some. Okay, we can't have anything here. Uh, let's check diplomacy again. I want to declare war on this faction. It's now obliterated, so it will not even provide or... Uh, have any kind of uh, a challenge for us. Are we improving? No, we are still deteriorating. Uh, join war against this faction. Let's see. They do not want it. Payment. Offer payment. I'm just checking to see if they will accept any kind of negotiation. If they do not want to accept anything. Not a big deal. 
Okay. We will we will decide what to do later. Now we have this secured at least. Uh, we are going in the minus. No problem. Uh, what to give her? It's gonna cost me a thousand. But she will has. Yeah, I'll give it to them. Just for the dryads for now because they are cheap. And you are gonna be taking a look around. Hunting. We need to take out these two, otherwise we cannot establish trade agreements with the dwarves, nor we can secure the port, so both of them are essential. For now let's just end the turn and see what the enemy are hiding for us. Or the AI. Now the thing is with the dwarves is they did not secure back their entire province. Okay, nice. So they declared war on the Molder clan. They will be having issues with them. That's for our own benefits. Uh, hunting buildings plus 10 percent. That's not bad. We need to improve the relations with the high elves. I the elf unit upkeep does not benefit me at all. Come from ports. This is for later. But the siege holdout is important. I'll go first with this though, because it's more important. And how many turns for that? Three more turns. Okay, I cannot upgrade you yet because you are expensive. And uh, let's first check the diplomacy. Okay, we are going down. Down, down. Are you gonna accept any kind of negotiation? No. Now, if I want to go towards the quest. They are just beside us. Anyways, let's see where is Middenheim. So it's here. We need to go this way. So I'll be trespassing this faction. Where? Oh, nice. We have really good movement range. Okay, okay. We are at minus a hundred. How strong is the? Okay, it's good. And how about that? We are still at minus six. Okay, hey, cool. We can have that now, which is great. Oh, this also needs. Okay, so this also needs the um, growth thing. So the growth is now even worse than before, because before patch we only focused on the tree itself, now every, basically most of the buildings need growth, infrastructure and defensive buildings. Uh, can we have any upgrade in six more turns, which is not cool. And let's end the turn. I gonna try to have a uh, co-deal. Then we can better focus on improving the situation. This quest is is, is fun, but uh, it just prevents you from focusing on something because you have to send a lord to track him out. I do like it, however. It's really nice addition to the game. Now we can have legendary heroes and it's really, really great. And uh, what to give? Uh, no, no, no. I I do like this as well. It's it's it has changed now. If you see the this uh, encounters for uh, the wood elves now have much better um, uh, just one second. Okay, so I'll go with the public order. 
Uh, let me just check it fast. So if I upgraded that, I'll be having access to this. Did she recruit her units? Yes. Um... I need more units, more tree men. I can, however, upgrade that. Do some... Yeah, I'll do it this way. Yeah, I'll do it this way. Just so she can get the movement range bonus. And uh, how many turns now? Six more turns to get one. Do we have any other building that increase the income? Nope. Need to manage with what I have. How many turns? Two more turns and we can rec build uh, this. What's going to give us? Two. Okay. Provide garrison. Not bad. Immune to vampiric. Okay. Naval Waken Forest. Okay. 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 Not bad. Again, what were we the we we're talking about the uh, quest rewards? Yeah, if you see now, the the quests give much better rewards than before, uh, especially with the equipment. Uh, I do like a lot of the changes. I would have loved if they improved the wood elves. However, instead of just improving the um, so he wants to declare war on me, it seems. That's the only explanation of that. And maybe the only thing that's preventing them now from declaring war on me is my defensive alliance with the dwarves. Okay. I have minus 800. Now let's see if we can reach Middenheim with the 50%. Middenland, Middenheim, yep, yeah, we are Middenheim here. Okay. Oh, it belongs to the Empire now. Not nice at all. So, he's gonna be waging war at me. I believe so. I do believe so. Let's see, uh, it's gonna cost me a thousand. No, uh, I do not want to pay that now. What can we build over here? Okay, next turn we can. No, we need to capture that. In fact, we must capture it. Otherwise, we'll keep on struggling with the uh, growth. Uh, okay, this is only if she is not on a mount. When mounted on a great eagle. Okay. Riders. So, she's gonna get terror. That's not bad. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do that. I'll put her on eagle, then I'll give her the terror. So she will become better. And she'll be able to catch basically anyone we want. Since the eagle has more movement uh, capabilities. Let's end the turn for now and see okay, who declared. Oh yeah, the, the Imperial Convoy. Uh, that's a quest related thing. Now once we're done with the quest we should be we should be fine because we'll be having a lord that focuses on the public order and if someone decides to clear war on us and there will be another lord that will be uh, capturing settlements uh, to just it's not like the the um, objectives um, is not to really go out and capture settlements, but as you can see, uh, the AI is not giving us any other chance than so. 
Okay, that's really good. That's really good. Okay, that's only for five turns, so... Do we have access? They already captured it. This freaking... Okay, in this case, we are becoming neutral with this faction. They have eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is not good for them. Grimgore is second, they are fifth, so now he's butchering them. And the Empire is seven, are fourteen. No one is in a good standard with us anymore because we are being neutral. Uh, anyone? Okay, yeah. So the fact that we are neutral, this uh, gives us a really bad... Uh, ...standards, basically. Anyways, let's look for Imperial Convoy. It's are they at war with each other's? No, they like each other's. Uh, you are... Okay, I want them to declare war on me. Uh, let's give him that. And, uh... I'm gonna be saving for the uh, growth, as I need to upgrade this building first. We need to go towards the port as well. Yeah. Any building here needs to be can be upgraded. Does it provide? Does it provide any boost to the income? No. No. So that's not cool. We need to start wars, otherwise we're gonna suffer from uh, the economy. Are they at war with each other? If they are... Okay, they... Okay. Should be destroyed. I'm not gonna go with military alliance, but I'll happily accept a defensive alliance to increase our position, so we need to improve the overall power of us. So no one declares war on us, and they are already at war with the uh, with the uh, greenskin, so uh, I don't think that we're gonna be suffering any kind of penalties for that, so I'll go with that. Oh, it's not ideal. I normally do not do that with other factions uh, when playing other factions, but as you see, uh, the Wood Elf economy suffers a lot and they are not the best. So um, we need to try and have some relations with the AI, otherwise we cannot really... Yeah, the thing is, if I captured that, I'll have issues with... Where are they? Okay, there they are. Next turn, I'll attack them. And, uh, yeah. Let's uh, scout a bit north to see where France is heading. Uh, can we build anything here? No. No. I'm gonna be saving for the upgrade. And uh, the public order does not provide anything special. Oh, well, it does provide some growth. I would have loved to see some improvements uh, to the income, though, like the high elves. Okay, does it provide any growth? Not yet. 
This is in the minus, so we suffer from growth, it seems. Yes. Okay, let's end the turn now. Let's see how it's gonna work. I need to do three. Yeah, I need to fight these dwarves. I have to. It's a must now. Because this will provide me... I can do... Um... Holy crap, all of these wars. Yeah, so if we win three battles against this, the, the dwarves, we'll be able to confederate uh, Durthu, and that's exactly what we want to do. Uh, let's see... Uh, where are these crappy guys first we're gonna get some cash out of them okay there they are Let's see if we can auto resolve it okay so we cannot auto resolve it we have to play it ourselves and good that we have this unit because otherwise they will be able to out uh, run us as you can see they have speed of 80 or so we cannot really reach him if not for this unit now, uh, well, let's fight it manually. We are going to try to minimize the casualties as much as possible. And I'm going to be giving it to her because she's going to be the one that's going to be um, healing us. Okay, so they do have only five range units. That's not a big deal. Codeal is close to be released, and I'm excited about that. I really like him a lot. Uh, even though I would have loved to see him really closer to the look of Durthu, he should look like um, a possessed tree more than like just a tree with flowers on the back. Yeah, but he's still really cool lord to have. Uh, now we're okay we are really close to them and we are gonna be tickling them uh, yeah we need to bring them a bit closer this way because where's their lord uh, you are gonna oh we cannot put them in the front because they are not trees you're gonna be in the back you are oh you are not yet on the um, I'll keep you in the back then and where are the wolves there they are I'll put them just try oh no they are far I'll put them just right here Okay, cool. Now let's attack. Just the, the wolves will come this way, and you are coming this way, and you are... What are you trying to do? Let's bring her here. Wonderful, wonderful for the wolves. Wonderful for the wolves. They cannot outrun the wolves. Just stop playing dumb. Uh, cause damage to combatants. Good for this single combatant. So let's do it this way. You're gonna be healing this unit. And uh, you are gonna be doing a spell over there. Okay, we are done on this side. Let's bring them close. And you are gonna keep fighting this guy. Uh, we are gonna be doing a spell just to do... Why are you not fighting? You know what? Come, come to the back. Where are the wolves? Okay, cool. They are finishing them off. And, uh, you are gonna be healing them back. You are gonna heal... And uh, 
you are where is the other guy you are gonna heal her okay that's not bad wolves finish this unit off it's bothering me Captain repositioning. Target acquired. They die. finish this stupid guy off and you are Yeah, this unit sucks, man. Let's just drive them out. Okay, take out this unit. Uh, where is their hero? There he is. Any... Okay, let's do a spell over there. Heal these units. Why are they... You know what? You keep fighting these units. Just finish it off already. Anyone else want to fight? Okay, they suffered the dryads. Let's bring them here. gonna suck on my nuts I want them to die simply want them to die what are these units anyways if free Company militia. Okay, I suppose we're gonna be having um, healing for these units instead of um, just look at these two. They suffered a lot of casualties, and the thing is, they are not really upgraded. Like they are not leveled up, so they do not have the extra um, protection from. Uh, uh, the Lord trait. Well, we don't have it even on this Lord. They did the most damage. They are always a good unit. They do a lot of damage. If used well. Well, most of our units are small entity units. That's why they have an advantage over them. Otherwise, they wouldn't have been able to do that much damage. Because they cannot deal much damage to large creatures like the tree men. But anyways, first phase of uh, the releasing the the uh, legendary hero uh, is basically done. Uh, let's see, only seven percent. In this case, I'm gonna go with the cash. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Now she has that. Raid Paravon. Okay, so he needs to keep on coming this way. Uh, I need to keep him intact. Okay, I, I cannot be pushing a lot now. We need to heal a bit. Uh, she is gonna go this... Okay, yeah. You are... I'm gonna go with more armor for her. Piercing, no. I do not want to decrease her... Uh... Oh. 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 No. How about you? Let's give him uh, more ambush. Okay. Charge bonus for Dryad. Sundering attacks. Only for him though. Or for Dryads, Treekin, and Tree Men. Ah, the physical resistance is only for him. However, they'll have 10% extra 
This is better. The armor is good versus everything, basically, not just the... Uh... Yeah. Thing is, I want to go this way first. This is good, but I want this first because look at my economy, it's it's suffering. And uh, let's see what if we have something that replenishes any Freeman, Riad, anything with a constant replenishment. We do have the decrease in income that we're gonna be getting. Or I can have that. You know what? I'll go with the um, with the upkeep first. Yeah, I'll go with the upkeep first. This is really good. I'm not saying it's bad. It's gonna help us improve. Um, well, we can we can. Yeah, if if we increase it 25, we will be able to upgrade these buildings faster plus we will have a minus one recruitment time for this so we can recruit in only one turn yeah this is also good then the third one will be this this is also good but this is gonna be waiting a bit so this is gonna be after income from selling building yeah so I'll go this, I'll go this first, then I'm going to keep up with that. Now this is fully, yeah, this at level, okay, cool, 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 let's see what do we have, okay, we have good, uh, we want to declare war on this faction now, I want to. And I do not care about Clan Angrund or whatever they are called. They want to join war. Let them join the war. It to capture these uh, territories, then capture that so we can establish trades overseas. Are they at war with someone? Let me just first check to see if they are at yes. war with someone. Oh freaking heck, if I declared war on them, I'll be at war with basically everyone How about this faction. Okay, they do not have any allies, so no, I'll go against this faction first. Let's see, can we capture it directly? Yeah, I'll, I'll finish off with this faction in this case first. They do not have any ally, and I'll be having access to the um, port. Let's see if we can auto resolve that. Okay, we cannot auto resolve this crap. So I have to play it myself, and uh, they do have good. Is she on the, uh, let me just check to see if she's on the hawk. Okay, cool, I'll be using her then. Okay. So, uh, let's look at the map layout. Okay. So, we'll be coming this way. Minimize, uh... Yeah, we'll minimize how they will be hitting us once she gets into fighting them. I'll bring these two as well on the walls now. And uh, we'll see how it goes. Should be able to win it. The only thing is just to reach the walls. Afterwards, it's fine. Because these guys are armor piercing and they can deal pretty a lot of damage. Once we are in that's why i want to first send uh, her and the heroes on the gates on the walls because they most likely are going to be shooting their own troops so 
we should be able to manage that. Three heroes are good. Okay, cool. Now uh, let's bring them this way. They should be hidden in the forest, I suppose. Uh, you are gonna come... Where is she? Uh, come on, girl. Okay. Everyone in the trees. Do they hide in the trees? Yes, it seems. And uh, let's do that now. First of all, you are coming this way, and uh, yeah. What are you doing, you? You should cease fire. I do not want you to be... Okay, cool. Done. Now that is done. Okay, okay. That's what I want to see. They started shooting at their own... Holy crap! How are they shooting on her? They should not be able to shoot on her like that. Anyway, let's bring her out. This crap now. Anyone else do they have who can really... Okay, let's bring her back here. Uh, we will be doing some... nothing. Let's... Uh... Okay, cool. We're gonna be doing another spell. Just wanted her to heal a bit. Okay, cool. Bring her out. Uh, they will be shooting her, it seems. She is on a big mount. Take her out. Come on, douchebag! Move on! Okay, I tag them. I hate these units. Come on, just climb back on the walls. Did she kill anything? Yeah. Okay, good, good, good. They are out. Stay on the gates. On the walls, sorry. Are uh, they... okay. Oh. Uh, I want you to shoot... Okay, now I can, in fact, destroy the gate. Who are they gonna be shooting? Oh. Almost missed. Calculated. Eh, nothing important. Okay, put them in. Maybe they will not be able to shoot, if so. Are they dealing damage to their walls? How much do we have? Okay, not a beat. Ideal. Uh, let's see what do we have. Okay, now once I'm done with that, how much do they still have? Okay, they have a lot. Uh, you 
want... Not for these units, I would have been able to take her out. Let's just uh, try to bring her here. Uh, first just here so we can heal her a bit. Oh, come on. She was out. Okay, not a big deal. Okay, they opened the gate. You can get out. And hide back in the trees. Damage 50%. How come? Oh, they opened the gate. Now, I want you to, if possible, can they stick on the gate? Yeah, they can stick on the gate. You want them to come here. I cannot just recklessly get in because they will butcher me. Uh, let's try to deal more damage with this. Okay, not bad. Well, in fact, bad, I want to say not good. Okay, stay... Yeah, attack, attack. So they will hit their own troops with that what is her okay I understand. she Fire cannot ahead. attack so bring her back okay that's cool here they are attacking their own troops which is nice now I should be able to bring the tree men. Okay, wonderful. They are helping me more than they are harming me. Let's heal. Let's see if we can hit them. Oh, come on, you freaking. Just shoot them. Are you gonna shoot today or you're just gonna keep looking at them? What's wrong with this stupid unit, man? Wipe your ass with something. Full of shit. What is she shooting at? Look at... She's giving me a headache. She's literally rubbish. I shouldn't have done that. Attack these guys. Where are they? Okay, nice. Finally, finally. Now we can heal better.
this one to finish off with their um, ammunition now and then I will bring the dryads in Do they still have? Let's bring them now. We do not have another gate, so yeah. Okay. Cool. Now I want them to blob up around my troops so I can do a spell. And hopefully it's gonna deal some damage. And once I'm done with that, I'll summon the Dryads. The woods rage. Orion sent me. How many kills? Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Okay, and let's summon some Dryads. That's awesome. Okay, not bad. Okay, we're doing well this side. And uh, let's decrease their attack. Perfect, now we're gonna capture the town square, we're gonna push towards it, uh, take this out, tag this guy, okay, uh, attack them, they're gonna push towards the town square because they do not want me to capture it, but we are doing well, yeah, mission over, like they do really well. And especially with that, once they are in melee, they can't uh, really... Yeah, so we did well. I was just trying to minimize the casualties. And we did manage to do minimal casualties, which is awesome. So we preserved somewhat our strength. And I suppose... I'm not sure if, if this will cause any... Uh, penalty to the diplomacy with the Empire, but hopefully it will not. Now I'll head towards the port. Now it's only gonna give me 100. I know it's not like before, it used to get 500, but... Yeah, we'll see once we're done with this faction what to do. I'm not sure if I'm gonna capture all of their territories or just take the port, then focus on the dwarves. Maybe I'll be doing that. Uh, 17, not bad, but I cannot afford it now. I'm not gonna risk it, then capturing it will decrease my army power because I have some dryads, so just gonna be occupying it. And uh, we can build the legendary building now. Oh, we cannot have this wanted to build that but no I'd rather be having some cash and uh, let us let us improve that it was really 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 good uh, can we have an upgrade nah we are still in the minus but we should manage uh, where is this guy Okay, he is in an ambush stance, and uh, who else do we have? 
I bet they do like me better now. Oh, they hate me even more. Why is that? Trespassing? Okay, it looks like I have... Well, they will be declaring war on me. I'm not going to be declaring war on them. But we shall see how it goes. Now, if they declared war on me, I'll directly head towards them. Uh, securing the trade route with the nice they are coming back let me check how strong they are third first so they definitely have a wall definitely uh, can I have another kind of defensive alliance with yes. someone oh no I do not want it not yet they are weak so Oh, they are even weaker. The problem is they only have one... Yeah. Is it destroyed yet? No. Okay, in this case, I'm gonna be... Keeping you here to scout a bit around and see what the dwarves are up to. And I'm not gonna be building anything at the moment. This is gonna give me 50 for... Nah, it's not worth it at all. Especially since our buildings are... Oh, this could be, could be good. It's gonna provide garrisons a lot of it. Yeah, so most likely once built, I have to take out this building. Two eternal guards, two blade guards, yeah. I'll take this out. But not now. Let's end the turn for now and see who's gonna declare war on us. Okay, good. Faction destroyed. Want to see the dwarves snowballing back. Want to see them number one soon. They have to become number one. They are my back. The east. Once we officially secure this. Okay, cool. Now, how many turns left? See, now we have 105. Can you reach that? No. Oh, if I captured that, just gonna check. No way I'm gonna be declaring war on this faction. Uh, so let's bring her 36. Just want to be able to see what's happening around. And uh, looks like there is no one here, so I'll go in and ambush just. Maybe they will decide. Okay, cool. Now we can give her the Coster when mounted on a Great Eagle. She's gonna remain on the Eagle for now. And it looks like we need to improve the Dryad since I'm not... don't think I'm gonna be taking them out of the army now. Well, maybe. Maybe. I'll, I'm, I'm not gonna upgrade it now. Uh, we have everything here. Now we are gonna start upgrading her. Why won't I? You know what? Then I'll go that. Yeah. Then I'll go this way. She also needs that. But I want to improve. Oh, I'll upgrade that first. Oh, wait. For Hawks. Yeah, it's not for her. Right? Yeah, it's not for her, so no. Forget it. Three kin? No. If it was three men, then yes. Okay. Yeah, nothing cool. Just upgrade her instead, then. And, uh, yeah. Let's see this guy. I'm gonna be moving him 50%, uh, 50% so he can heal a bit. 
Just let me see how much he's gonna heal up for. Uh, so it's gonna take forever. So now, just keep going. Let's uh, reach Paravon fast. Uh, can we have any upgrade next turn? As for you, mm, nah, nah. Oh, next turn as well, we're gonna be having another upgrade. It's gonna increase by a hundred. Wow, that's a lot. That's huge, in fact. Defender of Athel Lauren. Okay. Okay, we checked it. We checked it. Keep up with that. Uh, Great Eagle units. Okay, who cares about Great Eagles anyways. Now this could be good. But first... Okay, um, four turns. I can have 200 instead of 100 from the port. But no, we need more uh, of the... Uh, Winds of Magic. The uh, Guy in Veil is important because it provides 40, 40 boost to the, uh, uh, the Winds of Magic, so this is really good. See how it is going. Minus 2, okay. Now this is gonna be Okay, now we have that. First, we're gonna upgrade you. And we are gonna be upgrading you as well. How are we doing? Nice. Soon, we're gonna be having the other forest yield. You are gonna capture it. Easy auto resolve, nice. Yeah, now because they do not have the extra armor and stuff. Okay, so we got a hundred. We got a hundred. And uh, let's see what she needs. Uh, okay. I'll keep on upgrading that, or or let's first upgrade this, plus 15 wins of magic, now we are at 110, okay, not bad. Okay, should I have non-aggression with them now, or peace treaty? Who calls? If they will accept it, calls. no, they do not want it. So, I'm not gonna give it to you. Now, Paravon is just here. If I went Force March, I can reach the same place. And they will not be... Okay, those dwarves... Why would I not declare war on them instead? Just declare war on them, keep on fighting them, then yeah, maybe that's what I'm gonna be doing. Then we're gonna confederate, uh, what's his name, Durthu, and we avoid a conflict on this side. Uh, let's upgrade them back, give them more armor piercing. Now, to 70 minus 150. They will be basically focusing on regular units, if so. They'll have a lot of melee defense, but that is better. 75 armor piercing damage, so they'll have 375. This does not have any side effect besides decreasing their speed. However, they are already uh, slow, so no, we don't want that. 1500, let's go for it. Okay, two more turns. And here. Okay, we're already on it. Let's uh, 
let's have that built now that we have somewhat good income let's check diplomacy anyone wants non-aggression uh, they hate me a lot this is improving because we are trespassing My right the Empire. they do not like me Okay, Reichland is fourth now. Anyways, this agreement with the dwarves is giving us a huge boost now. Because Reichland do not want to fight the dwarves. And dwarves are reliable, so if Reichland decided to declare war on me, the dwarves are going to back me up. Uh, do we have uh, vision over the um, Lothurn? Uh, I still cannot build a trade agreement because of this. Yeah, because this faction captured the... Uh... Okay, so it looks like they are heading towards me. Action destroyed. I need to finish off with this stupid quest. Paravon. No, Paravon is here. Can we reach it on 50%? We cannot. So, either ways. Let's heal. This is Paravon. And to raid we need 50%. Douche, I'm at 52. Why can I not have a freaking... Screw you, dumbass. Stupid. Anyways. Okay. They are at war with each other, so I do not want to increase my enemies. Let's go back. We got what we want. We just wanted to have a port. And now I am gonna be uh, sending her it seems north. These dwarves are a pain. I'm not gonna be fighting them, at least not now. Once I can send this guy back home, we will see what to do with them. can have at least one more forest. We can boost the income a bit. Now the thing is, we need this to heal. Okay, they are coming back at me. No, they are coming back to capture that. Yep, expected. Now that could be good in fact, because if I started war against them, I'll be able to I'll be able to confederate this faction. And we do want that to happen. Now let me just first finish off with uh, are we in Paravon? Yes. So let's raid Paravon. We will uh, do the Codeal quest and we will have Codeal. Then we will call it for this video. Uh, where is, where is, where, what? Give her. Let's give her that. And uh, you are. Yeah, most likely gonna be. 
You know what? Let me send this guy. Where is he? This guy here. Do we have? Yeah, because we do not have uh, contact with them yet. Once we have contact with them, I bet they will give me um, the uh, whatever the the uh, diplomacy thing. Now next turn we should be able to declare a military action. Why? Greetings, honorable. They were at war with each other, so they need to like it instead. With their stupid grudges. Anyways, you keep on raiding. Uh, let's see what to have. Let's increase what. Okay, that, that's... My construction cost for all buildings. Let's do this. We are at minus 500. They will finish off next turn. Okay. We need three though. Let's end the turn and uh, it seems... Okay, we do have Codial now, which is great. And I can send this guy back home, finally. Finally. Once he's back home, we'll see. I'm not gonna be... Yep, yep, yep. Exactly, exactly what we expected. But that's not a problem. Not a problem. Gonna be raising it, because they cannot capture. Okay, they backed me up. I give them a plus. Now they will ruin everything. So, uh, Drake, I need to go fast north. Okay, that's cool. Now we... Against who? For that? No, I'm not gonna be sending him this way. Okay, so where is he? Where is this guy? Where is this guy? And uh, for Drica. Bring her. Why am I having that? No, I'm not gonna be starting this. Once this uh, the, the the lord that I'm sending here arrives, I'm gonna place him here. He will be doing the um, uh, reviving thing. While Draka will be focusing on these guys and uh, Codil. Where is he? There is Codil. We should be able to do it. Uh, let's do the Codil quest. And he will spawn beside her, I suppose. Yep. Let's teleport. Let's see what it is about. Uh, we should be able to do it. Should be able to do it. Let's fight. See first how the map looks. We'll see. At least we'll be having Codial in this uh, episode. They do have Zotes, they have... Those are the most dangerous unit, in my opinion. Yeah, they are the most dangerous. I love We Watchers.
Okay. Let's move in this way first. And where is she? You're gonna be with your hawks. Uh, let's scout a bit on the side, and uh, let's send these guys on the side as well. I love those trees. Rika has the best color combination in the game now. Tree men are awesome. I love the sound of it. Sound badass. What's that? Oh, why are they here? Are you kidding me? Anyways. You attack. And uh, you summon one of your dryads. So they can stop shooting at me. Or if they stop shooting at me. And uh, you are gonna keep eating them. You will have my potato wedges stuck in your throat. And uh, what do we have here? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Destroy that. Uh, okay. Who's this guy? Yeah, she's the their lord. Oh, where is she? There she is. Okay, wonderful. Destroyed. Nice, nice. One is destroyed. Three men are the best unit now. Okay, what do we have? We are stuck, so we retreat. Yeah, we do not want to fight that. We want you to go back. Blade Captain will be doing... Okay, destroy that. How much damage are we doing? Nice, done. I love this quest. <laughs> I love this quest. This is so cool. Now everyone is gonna come this way. You are gonna follow up your mom and you are coming this way while you are gonna be securing our flanks. Let's check what do we have here. Okay, nice, they are doing well on this flank or on this side of the battle. And ooh, the bats are doing well. Okay, okay. Everything is cool and steady. Dry car. Attack this trash. Where is this unit? Come to check what mom wants. Okay, we're doing really well. This quest is simply easy, in fact. 72, 25, that's, that's something. Okay, yeah, this is the unit that got summoned, so you don't really care about it. Uh, Dryka can keep on attacking the trash. We 
You are nothing. Die now. And uh, let's heal. Okay, they are not mine. I do not care much about them. Oh, they do not die anymore. Wow. Uh, let's bring my hawks. Okay, no, I do not want to bring them yet. Let's let's stay in the back. Let's stay in the back. Okay, nice. You are coming now this way. And uh, for you, let's bring you this side, or let's this side. As for you, let's now we can bring you because. Way watchers, way watchers, so many way watchers, dude. Okay, Draika is gonna summon another dryad here. Where is Draika? Move, you prick. Okay, nice. First one down. Second one down. Come on, summon it. Units attack those crappy guys, and you are gonna attack this while the wolves are gonna rush in. You can't do thing. Look how weak they became because of that is great improvement to the dryads. Go in and destroy the pillar. We want the Lord to come. Okay, go back. Run! Run! How fast are they? 95. They are faster than my units used. In this case, we are gonna help you out. Wild Rider. Wait. And prepare for your demise. Now let's push, push in. Push in. Yeah, why this unit is in by herself? Heal her. Where was it? Okay, nice. Everyone attack them now. You are gonna die. Simple, right? Now you come back this way. Uh, any archers in this? No, no archers, so not bad. Who is attacking what? Yep, so this unit does matter. It's uh, the summoned unit. Soon we're gonna be having uh, the Lord released. And let's see if we can rush in with this force here. Attack them. They will be able to take it out. Okay, nice. Attack everyone. Uh, do we have another summon? No. Who is this? Okay, this is my uh, hero. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Run. They are anti-large. We cannot deal with them. Cool. This quest is so freaking awesome. I'd love to see him more badass though. Good 
This is so freaking cool. Awesome. <laughs> I really am enjoying this to the max. This is so freaking cool. Uh, let's attack this crap. Attack this crap as well. Assault. What does it do? It's good, we're single combatant, so we uh, Kowadil. Yeah, I would have loved to see spikes still instead of those um, flowers on his back. Would have been really freaking badass. And without this beard, maybe something else like these guys, for example. Anyways, this is awesome. Like, I have nothing against it. This is so cool. This is a great quest, great addition. I love the legendary heroes added. It's so good. And even the scenario itself is so good. It's not like a generic just battle and having some stuff fighting. This is great. This is really great. They did so well here. They did so well. I give them a plus, a huge plus for it. Oh, you get the forest spirit to back up their lord. She came to back her master and bring him out of prison. This is so freaking cool. This great. Any unit with ammunition so we can deplete? Nah. Want to see the battle. Where is this guy? What I'm looking for. He is so cool, dude. <laughs> Angry tree men. Anyone else want to fight the beast master? No one can live while he live. I want you to stay out of battle. I do not want to lose you now. Go back, go back, go back, go back to the rear back. And uh, leave the battle to the trees now. Commander. Awesome. I love his voice acting. Yeah, you want to fight Codil? Come and get it. Yeah, right. This is great. Looks like I'm gonna be doing an entire army of tree men here. Just because now I have the master. Want to keep looking at this awesomeness. <laughs> awesome. It's definitely much like I like it. Uh, who do we have here? Okay, dead. Why we don't have the army loss penalty yet? Why? Why? Let's just fast forward. Don't see any reason for it. Do they have something that's unbreakable? I don't think so. Yeah, finally done. Okay, Codeal. Yeah, we're gonna be taking out one of the Dryads. Plug Codeal instead.
and I'm excited for the next episode. I'll be doing Codeal. Want to see the third tree man uh, in the next installment to Warhammer 3? Because now Codeal is the second. Um, the third one is uh, the Durthu, and there is another guy that's the oldest. He's not uh, shown yet. I bet he's gonna show up in the third installment. He's gonna be a beast. Still, the most badass is. Um, believe I need to put them beside each other's uh, Kodil and uh, Durthu. Durthu looks looks cooler because he doesn't have flowers on his back. He has spikes, and I prefer spikes over flowers. Uh, we're gonna go with Cash. Yep. Welcome back home, Kodil Sama. Where is he? There he is. Now uh, we are going to take out this unit because it is the lowest level unit. So I can't put him in this. Okay, so uh, next turn is going to get into the army. Yeah, and I'm going to... Okay, now we will start upgrading. Okay, now, now we can have it. And, uh, nice, in fact, that's nice. This is good to have, but, but, gonna go, we need to get this as well. Let me first give her that. We still have 11 new, uh, points to spend. So let's make some calculation. 11 she we need to improve Brica. so let's say we give her one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven or Or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No, she's gonna become weaker now. No, no, no. Let's let's give her this tree. Uh, worst case scenario, we'll add another. Uh, Dark, um, dark caster dryad in her uh, army, but Codiel has some good spells, so he should be fine. We have, we have this is good. We're gonna be giving him these three, five units here. He's gonna get something we'll we'll see once he start to improve in level and we're gonna be giving him this as well since it's gonna stick in the army to heal it better uh we'll see his he has some some interesting spells and he has some huge boosts so if we add the 30 is gonna be 140 yeah he's, he's really good now let's see what do we have more uh, I'm sending him to to have um, contact with this no. faction. Uh, training, yeah, let's go with training. Why did he stop? Why did you stop? Yeah, silently. Uh, six more turns to upgrade one of you. This will decrease and uh, 
how many more turns two more turns to level up uh, something else and uh, now they most likely are coming this way but this guy will reach it first hopefully and we're gonna complete his army here she's gonna face off those guys and complete her army there and okay now i suppose i need to take this out because we can only have 20 units and um let's take it out what buildings are we missing so we need one of this it only provides so uh, three more buildings one two you know what it provides two eternal guard shield and two glade guard Glade guards, eternal guards, shields, they went out. What does this provide? Glade riders, so either that or the glade riders. Glade riders, branch race. Yeah, I don't need that. However, it provides 100% ammunition, so no, this is good. Yeah, so if we upgrade it even more, it's going to become not bad. Yeah, I'll keep it. It's 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 going to provide us with the uh, ammunition extra, and yeah, this is not bad, in fact. So I'll keep it. And uh, what else uh, here? It's not bad either. It's not bad. And let's end the turn. Let's end the turn and call it for this video. This awesomeness is becoming greater over time. Just want... Uh, declared war ah uh, yeah this faction is stupid I want to be more reliable uh, nah, forget about that and the other dwarves I have no idea why they declared war on each other's this faction is gonna ruin everything here if Drica does not reach them fast okay good they did not raise it that's good. They are weak, but they simply ruin your stuff. Uh, relation with the Wood Elves. I don't care about the Wood Elves. Let's go with the fruit. Let's refuse it. They will not declare war on me anyways. Yep, so let's call it for this video. Drika is is yeah she will be able to finish them off next turn she's fully healed yep 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 and bring in your commander and uh, she is gonna come this way yep so uh this guy is coming back home as well now we're going to be facing some trouble because we are trespassing everyone. Yeah, so we need to keep pushing this way. Anyways, uh, let's call for this video. I hope you are enjoying it so far. Uh, give us a like and subscribe for more content. Give me... Uh, a note below or leave a comment if you want me to play a specific faction uh, or specific campaign. Uh, this is me, Cypher. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.